Well, like for, for shoes, Louis Vuitton and, and Gucci are, are up there. Um, if you would ask me three years ago, I, I probably wouldn't be saying that. But for the most part, I'm, I'm kind of all over the place. Ferragamo is, is something that, that I really enjoy. A couple of us went and, and shopped in New York throughout the season and got a couple Richard James suits. So those were kind of in style for, for our team this year. So I just try to, to learn from the older guys. But now the, the kind of the younger guys are taking over and, and showing the, the older guys the new styles. Yeah, Vinny Le Cavalier, um, obviously someone I, I looked up to. He was first overall pick too, so when I came, I was kind of watching him pretty close. Uh, more so the on-ice part, but he's a very fashionable guy. He's, you know, really into the designer clothes and he's always well-dressed, so I uh, took some tips from him. I think I've matured in, in the way I, I dress now. Um, before it was kind of, you know, shorts and a t-shirt and a baseball hat and flip-flops and you're ready to go. Now, you know, I like my nice pair of jeans and in Tampa we can get you know a lot of v-neck t-shirts um, we're spoiled down there with with the nice weather all the time so and we can afford to, to have the the light colored suits down there all season so not so traditional suit once in a while just to, to see uh, what the guys say about it but we got some fun guys on our team so they like it oh uh, well, my watch I mean it's something that um, I've matured and, and started wearing watches before as a kid you know you're all playing different sports and it was just something that um, you know, I never really came accustomed to, but now, um, you know, with the partnership with Tissot and, and my signature watches, it's definitely something that I enjoy wearing. And I think more so, um, I like just for style reasons uh, and fashion reasons, it, it looks good. So it says a lot about a man, the watch he's, he's wearing. So. The, the first one was kind of a, a more sporty watch. It, it had a lot of um, hockey tied into it, kind of a fresh face coming into the NHL, and now it's kind of more um, sleek, I think. I, I really like they, they've incorporated some Tampa Bay blue in there for, for me, and um, it's somewhere you could wear sporty, but wear with a suit as well. And I think, um, you know, as I've kind of progressed in the fashion world too, it, it really suits the, my, my style. Well, with, with the run we made in, in the playoffs last year, it was kind of heartbreaking, uh, you know, losing in Game 7 to the Eastern Conference Finals to the eventual Stanley Cup champions. So that's motivation in itself for us to get back to that point and, and hopefully get over the hump and win a championship. But, um, you know, if you ask anyone in the, in the league, that's their goal uh, for, for myself personally is just to keep maturing as, as a player and take on more of a leadership role this year. It was, you know, just finished my third year in the league and kind of feel guys out and, um, you know, you're learning every day, so I want to be a guy that, that can be counted on in all situations and um, just keep improving and hopefully the offense still comes.